How much should I spend on my airsoft gun is a question I get asked all the time. A lot of people think that the more money they spend, the better the gun is going to be, and while that's true to a degree, there's more to it than that. To demonstrate, I'm going to introduce you to something called the Law of Diminishing Returns. Right here at the bottom of the graph, we're going to put the pinnacle of airsoft engineering, the spring-powered rifle. This thing is cheap, and to be honest, it shoots pretty bad, but if we triple our money, we get a gun that is easily three times better. This is able to shoot in full and semi-auto, has adjustable hop-up, and if you're wanting to get into airsoft on a budget, this is a great option. If we triple the price of that, in my opinion, we get into the best value for money airsoft guns. Instead of cheap plastic, you get polymer external parts, the gearbox is made of metal, and this will last you a long time. Once we triple that, you can really start to see the diminishing returns start to come into play. This is the Crytac LVOA, and for three times the price, you're only going to get a slightly faster rate of fire, and instead of a polymer upper, it's going to be made of metal. 